So what happened at the end of last year? I hurt myself. Liam Whaley, podium finisher in 2018 and 2019. Second place finisher also at this year's GKA Big Air Tarifa. Uh, he is a world champion, of course, freestyle world champion. Liam Whaley needs no introduction, one of the biggest deals in the sport right now from Spain. And <laughs> 2023 couldn't have started in a better way. Winning the first event of the year in France. <laughs> becoming overall vice world champion. getting back into boots and refinding my passion for freestyle. And then coming second at the most extreme event in kiteboarding, the Red Bull Mega League. Unfortunately, the year didn't end the way I had planned. So Liam, how did last year end? It didn't end in the best way. <laughs> um, unfortunately, I injured my back during the Red Bull Mega Loop. It was a super crazy event. A crazy storm came through, the perfect conditions to run the most extreme event in kiteboarding and I was feeling great on the day, um, full of adrenaline, so I didn't feel any pain and everything worked out really well. I was really happy with my performance. A few hard crashes, but nothing um, that stood out where I thought that I hurt myself. And yeah, I went to sleep that night, super happy with my performance and woke up the next day in a huge amount of pain. I was curled up in a ball on the floor and I couldn't find any position that was comfortable. And uh, I took some days off the water. I thought I just strained myself. And then I tried kiting again after about 10 days and a similar thing happened. I was in a, a huge amount of pain again. After that, I went to get some tests done and they told me I had an injury in my back and I was going to have to take some time off of the water. I asked how much time, but uh, there was no answer to that. Days turned into weeks, weeks turned into months and unfortunately I had to miss out on the most important event of the year, the Red Bull King of the Air. That was super challenging for me mentally. So yeah, since then, I've just been having to take things day by day, um, do the, the right amount of training on my back to not strain myself even more, but to make some progress. I'm happy that things are, are starting to, to take shape and I'm starting to feel better again, but um, I can't say when I'm going to be back on the water. Hopefully that day comes very soon.